guys welcome back to my channel so today we'll be talking all about this hair that you guys see on my head so this is the mink brazilian hair from kendra p so this is the bag that it came in i have in my head 14 16 18 i think i got a 16 inch closure but the closure is not from them it's either from kendra's hair boutique or big old bundles i'm not really sure but we'll get into that later you guys can see in the title i said two year update or three year update one of the two so technically it is because i had this hair in this bag in my closet since i bought this and i bought this hair two and a half years ago you can look at my first video that i reviewed on it the initial you know unboxing and everything like that i'll put it right here i'll link it down in the description box i did not install this hair until literally wednesday of this week is friday right now and i got this hair installed on wednesday and these are the curls from wednesday as i slept on them and everything obviously i tied up my hair but this is the curls that the girl did um that did my hair so yeah i'm not sure if the curls holding like this because of the curl and iron she used because she has a t3 curl and iron which is super hot or is because the hair is a good quality so give you guys an up close look of the hair and what it looks like so that's what it looks like super good quality so we're going to get into the pros and the cons and everything like that and if you should buy this hair so once again this is mink brazilian hair by kendra p i wanted this hair for a very long time because i knew the quality was good and i was just sick of buying hair again and again and again and just having to sell it or throw it away because it didn't live up to the hype basically so like i said i got a closure sewing 14 16 18 i'll put on the screen how much it would cost for you today to get this type of hair basically with um i don't know the shipping cost i think it was like 12 dollars or whatever when i got it but that was two and a half years ago so into the pros and the cons so the pros of this hair the quality the quality is unmatched even the hairstylist could tell that this was raw hair for a long time i believe that the, the hair can last you up to like three years or something like that if you take care of it obviously so that's why i got it to use over and over and over again you can color this hair it'll be fine i've seen many reviews on people that has colored this hair and a whole bunch of stuff to it heat etc so it's built to last and the hair just it holds up basically like you see the quality you see the shine and this is me just literally i took my bonnet off so this is what i used to tie my hair but i took my bonnet off and i had this around my closure area and i didn't really do anything i didn't touch the curls i did a little um hot comb on top of my closure because it has a lot of flyaways for some reason so i did that and that was pretty much it as for shedding and tangling i haven't got any tangling i had got like one little snag when i just did like that to the bottom of the curl but that was about it as for shedding she did cut the 14 handle to the four to lay flat and everything but the 18 and the 16 inches is not cut but the 14 is so i am getting a tiny bit of shedding like maybe like two or three strands or a strand or two so it's nothing crazy or nothing like that but i can run my hands through it right now see if i get anything see i got one like i said the 14 inch bundle is um cut so keep that in mind if you guys don't want to cut your webs make sure you guys tell your stylist but she didn't want it to be bulky um because it is a sewing so it needs to lay flat as possible so that's as for the cons so obviously the first con is the hair is very expensive i had looked to see if i wanted to get a 20 inch bundle instead of having the 18 because i don't wear hair this short usually my longest hair is like 22 inches 24 inches but it's expensive so i had to get the 18 i figured it would be okay so the 18 stretch, stretch come down to like right here my chest area basically so it's not that bad especially like when i straighten it and that's how the back looks right there so it wasn't that bad i feel like the 18 is more of like a 20 to me it's a long 18 so that thing is the 20 inch bundle was 150 just the one bundle so keep that in mind this hair is very very pricey if it wasn't for the pandemic i probably wouldn't have bought this hair until i really saved up the money for it or whatever but yeah I said, let me get it now because I've been wanting my dream hair. If you guys don't know, Cash Doll wears this hair. So if you guys see her hair all the time, this is the hair that she's wearing because this is her best friend's hair company. So she's the model for it and everything like that. So yeah, I got a little bit more shedding right here that just came out. Mind you, I haven't done anything to my hair since I got it done, but tie it up. <laughs> Literally, I haven't done anything. I haven't combed through. I haven't played with it nothing like another con for me is that when i got the hair and if you go back to my first video two of the bundles 16 and 18 was good it was like a dark color but the the 14 was actually like literally brown like a like a number four if you know what that color is it was literally brown so i said okay i'm gonna have to color this because if i don't it's not gonna match with the hair so that i did color it like i use um <clears throat> brown black to color it or whatever it got a little bit dark but i was like it'll blend in because of the closure 
in the hair. I don't know if you guys can tell, if you guys can see the difference or whatever, but she said that it was a little bit dark. I told her if she don't wanna use the 14 inch, she don't have to use it, but she did end up using a little bit and it worked out. I knew it would, but yeah, I don't really see a difference. So yeah, that was fine. Other than that, yeah, hope for the darkest bundles possible because that's what I always try to do when I'm ordering hair. Please give me the darkest bundles possible because that brown one was like way off. It was like black, black, brown. Like <laughs> literally, you could see the difference like big time. So that's what I didn't like. Um, I think shipping was good. Gotta go back to my first video. The cons, it's expensive. One of the bundles came super light and that was pretty much it. That was the only two cons I have for right now. I just started wearing the hair like literally since Wednesday. It's now Friday, so... I don't really know how the hair is gonna behave. Like I said, it's been in my closet for two years, two and a half years in this bag, doing nothing. And this is how much hair I got left from the 14 inch bundle that I colored. So she used everything but this. So this is everything that I don't have. So this is what the hair looks like on the bundle. Oh, she said also the tracks are super thick. So the, she had a hard time getting the needle through there. She got it through obviously, but she said the tracks were super thick. So keep that in mind if you're gonna be doing your own hair um because you know we have thick tracks it's really hard to put the needle through so that she did give me a discount code but i don't know if it still works you guys can go check my first video i'm pretty sure i have it in the video or whatever but yeah oh a lot a one big big con i forgot to tell you guys about she is always sold out that's great for her but for us trying to get the hair all the time or whatever it's not so she tells you like when she's gonna do a restock so check her instagram and everything like that you guys will know when the restock is but it's really hard to get in the restock i'm shocked that i even got this hair honestly um but yeah it's like exclusive so if you guys want this hair you're gonna have to be stalking the website to see when everything's available you might have to buy some now some later i know a lot of people like down the line they'll keep two bundles that they first had and then they just add another one once the bottom one gets old or whatever or if they want to add more length eventually i probably will buy a 20 inch bundle or a 22 i might just buy a 20 just so it could be a little bit longer on me or whatever but yeah that's pretty much what i wanted to tell you guys it's just the initial install of the hair i'll let you get a good look at it one more time when i curl it by myself will the curls hold like this like i said she did have a super hot um curling iron a t3 but this has been curled <laughs> for the last since wednesday and it's friday now so yeah and the curls don't seem like they're going anyway oh and this is body wave. i forgot to tell you guys this is a body wave texture some people said that the straight hair didn't curl as much like the curls didn't last or whatever so i would highly recommend if you're going to do styles i do a lot of like crimps in my hair i do a lot of curls in my hair long curls etc so if you guys are going to guys are going to style your hair just try to get body wave or whatever you want to do they have body wave straight i believe she has deep wave all of the above when you can get it when it's in stock so keep that in mind so that's pretty much what i want to tell you about this hair if you have any questions leave them down below for me about this hair so it's mink brazilian by King kendra p I'm gonna see because i'm gonna plan on using this hair over and over and over again and to color it at first like you know like highlights or something like that but i'm just gonna wait and see like how it goes i don't want to ruin the hair because the hair is really 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 good probably the best hair i've ever had so far off of off of initial interaction with it and stuff like that so yeah like i said ask me any questions down below hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you next time